first-hand guilty of, you know, when things haven't been going well in my life. <laughs> On social media, I'm posting shirtless pictures to get, you know, likes and validation. Um, and I lived in LA for uh, eight years. Believe it or not, everything you see in LA is true. <laughs> and I started to realize it's a lot of smoke and mirrors. And, um, you know, so I said, I think life may, you know, helped with this show. It's not, you know, all my life. Some of it's things I've seen. But I, I think that uh, uh, this generation, I mean, everyone is part of social media, whether they're partaking or not. But um, I noticed that it had some, it kind of made me depressed, you know, I'd have weeks where I wasn't doing much as an actor, and I'd see everyone really, like, having these really busy, amazing lives and perfect images, and it just kind of made me down. Um, so I think there's some amazing things we can connect, we can learn, we can, we can get some great things from social media, but there are a lot of negatives, so I think hopefully we can highlight them, and then we can all become a bit more aware of it in our own lives, not to spend so much time looking for happiness in your phone, but rather just looking for it in real life.